Let's keep this simple, straightforward, easy peasy. Okay. Big Mom versus Fujitora. Uh, no, 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 no. Now, first of all, spoiler warning for any non-manga readers of One Piece, one time for the one time, you will be spoiled. Now, listen. Fuck here! You know my agenda. It's very simple. Yonko over the Admirals. No Admiral is as strong as a Yonko, period. And Fujitora loses to Big Mom if they go 1v1. Let's keep it simple and straightforward. Number one, strength. Big Mom outclasses Fujitora in strength in almost every freaking category imaginable. Lifting strength, striking power, you name it, Big Mom has him beat. Fujitora is getting pushed back by a gear th three. Dress Rosa Luffy pushed back. Big Mom, Whole Cake Island, Gear 4. <laughs> Stop. No, 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 no. Big Mom is blasting through the Big Father with this raw woman might. If you have Fujitora with this bare fist, with this bare knuckles, no hockey, no nothing, just bare knuckle, punches Capone's Big Father, he's going, owie, <sighs> no, the pain. That's Fujitora. That's not his forte. Fujitora, he doesn't go to the gym. Do you lift, bro? No, he doesn't lift. Big Mom goes to the gym every day damn morning 5 a.m on the dot and doesn't miss a beat i'm telling you listen people think it's all blubber no it's all muscle big mom is all muscle all woman and you gotta respect it you gotta respect it number two dc destructive capacity fujitora i'll admit he does probably have more aoe than big mom considering how he has the meteorites and they can go at a pretty wide range and they're pretty damn powerful. He can even spam these things too. He's eating ramen while dropping meteorites. That, that's pretty impressive. And then we also have the Dress Rosa rubble feet. Whoa. All the rubble across the entire island Rosa. Just picks it up. Mmm, gravito. That's impressive. You can pick that up and then just drop it like that. That's pretty scary DC in terms of area of effect. Absolutely. And then maybe, maybe he can even do bigger things. Maybe even lift bigger things up or bring bigger things down. The question, of course, is how big? How big of an object can Fujitora handle? I don't like where this is going. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. But Big Mom, in terms of the AOE, in terms of DC, ain't no joke. The God of Lightning... Tenju, ooh. The God of Lighting Tenjin is absolutely stupid. Yeah, it's it's kind of stupid. Not only is the entire sky lit up in a lightning array, NL's impressive, but even he'd be like, God damn, what the hell? Oh! And the bolts track. When you're making the Rumble Rumble Fruit user sweat by outputting even greater lighting than him, you have to give Big Mom that dub. You have to. It is what it is. So AOE, Fujitora probably on paper has more, but Big Mom, based on the feats, we can say, yeah, Big Mom is still kind of nuts in AOE. And to be fair, you can say, well, that was all Zeus, but what Zeus can do, I'm willing to bet Hera can do, and then some. I'm willing to bet a lot of money. Like, throw down at least a grand, at least a grand on that. I'm confident in that. But even still, when it comes to potency DC, there ain't nothing. There ain't nothing like an L bass spear. Oh my God. Just, just. When Big Mom winds up, oh man. That home run hit. Absolutely devastating. Absolutely soul crushing. Jesus, man. I think it's just nasty. L bass spear, in my book, L bass spear over the blast breath. Without emphasis. Without. A doubt, absolutely. We've seen this thing just blow across entire islands, just pulverize everything in its wake. It's just dumb. Even with the Raging Tiger, or, or let's say a fleet of meteorites, in terms of attack potency, DC potency, ain't nothing, ain't nothing like an Elbaf Spear. I mean, Big Mom, she is the best sword woman in One Piece. That, that, that's a fact. She is the best sword woman in One Piece. 
Why is Zoro bothering with Mihawk when Big Mom is literally the world's best swords woman? And I'll be real, Big Mom over Mihawk. Oh, yes. Yonko Bill different. Big Mom over Mihawk. I mean, clearly Queen was wrong. Clearly. Clearly. When Big Mom can do something like that, yeah, it's called Elbath Spear. But it uh, uh, doesn't matter. Because she's swinging a sword. Oh, maybe actually if we do get Big Mom a spear. Oh, oh. Maybe the reason why Katakuri has the most spear is because Big Mom's true final form is her holding a spear. You have to wonder. You definitely do. Now, speed. I don't think you have any idea how fast I really am. We got to give speed, attack speed, to Fujitora. We do. All right. It is what it is. The man's rings can pull meteorites from God knows where, right? Like, these meteorites are flying around in the Dragon Ball Z universe. Fujitora just grabs one and pulls to the One Piece universe, and they just rain down consistently. You have to wonder, okay, hold on, about, if these rings are that fast, he's at least, at least competing with someone like Hizaru in terms of attack speed. Like, in his case, gravity is really quick. Like, he's the Empress of Blackbeard. His gravity is pretty damn quick. And the same goes for his reaction speed as well. His reaction speed is pretty nuts, too, because of the observation hockey. You have to respect it. The man is clean with the observation hockey. Big Mom sometimes is just, it's just ugh, too, too damn goofy to dodge properly or react properly. Brooke, Brooke would know full well. Full well. Yeah, Big Mom is goofy that time. She, she is. It is what it is. However... However, in terms of travel speed, Big Mom is kind of gross. Recall how fast she was when she was riding Zeus when she was giving chase to the Straw Hats first time round on Hokage Island. It was kind of like the Mario Kart turtle on the cloud that scoops you up when you fall out of the track. But this time around, is there to kill you? Yeah, yeah, th that's pretty scary. That's actually very haunting. So Big Mom on top of Hera, zip around the clouds like some crazy evil Nimbus. Yeah, Fujitora's gonna be sweating a lot of buckets. Matter of fact, he actually may die of dehydration as a result of so much sweat. But again, that's what you get when you have the strongest woman in the verse. That, that's what you get. Now, durability slash endurance. <laughs> it is not even a contest, and we all know it's the truth. We all know it's the truth, okay? No offense, Ujitora, but when two admirals fight against Sabo and the Rev, and Fujitora all banged up the way he was, that's not a good look. That's not a good look for the admirals, especially when you compare them to the iron balloon that is Yonko Big Mom. Two admirals, two, against Sabo and a few good men. Like he was Ramsey Ball, just give me 10 good men. And they got at least one Admiral banged up. Okay. All right. Big Mom in that situation, solo? Uh, mm -hmm. Let me not jump the gun, but considering the Iron Balloon, I have my doubts she's gonna be as banged up, if at all, compared to Fujitora. Now you may say, well, <laughs> Well, Raw gave her a shocking willy. Oh my god, whoa, shocking willy. <laughs> but, Law's broken. Law's broken. Sometimes folks forget, but Law has had, to date, to date, Law has had some of the best feats in the verse. Not in the post time skip or the pre time skip alone, but in the entirety of the series, movies and all, he's had some of the best feats in the verse. That's how broken Law is at times. Honestly, I would say that Law is actually kind of nerfed because of what we've seen in Punk Hazard. Law's kind of nerfed. But keep in mind that this is not a 1v1, and that's not happening in a 1v1 when she is focused on Kid at the time. Yeah, of course Law can come behind her and give her a nice shocking willy, but in a 1v1, that's not gonna fly. It's just not. Especially when Hera and Prometheus are there as well to handle business. And to keep it a buck, if Fujitora takes, let's say, a shock willy, then this man's moniker gets downgraded to the purple disabled tiger. Well, I mean, he gets, okay, fine. 
He's already blind. So uh, the the purple even more disabled tiger. Okay. So no, the shock willy is a very damn good attack. And Fujitor in that case, he ain't dofy. He can't stitch his organs back together. He can't use gravity to like mend. It. No, no, no shot. No, if he could, okay, fine. You know what? Fair enough. I'm wrong. I lied clearly. But there's a good chance he can. So because he's not the Sky Demon or the Big Mom herself, then Fujitor after a Shock Willy is done. But Big Mom, she can still keep on kicking. Big Mom built different. Big Mom built different from birth. That's, again, the best woman in One Piece in all sorts of ways. And then finally, abilities. Listen, man, controlling gravity is dope and all. It is. I think it's a very cool power, without a doubt. Fujitora, Blackbeard, I think what you see from those guys is pretty cool stuff. I like gravity, okay? I mean, after all, it does keep me on this planet, which I can appreciate. I really can. While the Earth is zipping around the cosmos, I don't get flown off somewhere. No, we all like gravity. True. However. Here we go again. Big Mom has just too many random avenues and random abilities in her favor, all right? She, there, there's just too many. Fujitora doesn't got some weird soul ability or mystic fire or lightning to damage Prometheus or Hera. He he does not. Maybe gravity can suppress them for a period of time, but he probably can't kill them because again, they aren't really living to begin with. They're just soul entities. And on top of that, suppressing Hera and Prometheus, that takes away his attention from the Brahma bull that is Big Mom. Oh my God. Just charge through this brother. And then keep in mind, at any point in time, she can infuse her attacks with Conqueror's Hockey and even output even more damage to not just ruin his day, but ruin his life. Gonna give this man a deadly, a fierce eyebrow raise and ruin his day. It is what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is, okay? We've kept it streamlined. We've kept it easy peasy, under 15 minutes. That's a good job from me. Normally, I'll go like 35, but under 15 minutes. And now you understand the general gist as to why Fujitora gets turned into a homie and joins the Big Mom click. All right, so I'm gonna see you cats on the next one. Let me know your stance <laughs> on the subject matter at hand. Kuzan, she's coming for that bootay. I'm gonna see you cats on the flip side. Be easy, take care, have a nice one.